Assalamualaikum and a very good day to my panel Madam Maria Miri binti Abdullah and my supervisor Dr. Amiruddin bin Ahmad. My name Nur Atikah binti Tazu Azhar. Today I want to present about my final year project with title Artificial Intelligence Marketing is Shaping Tourism Industry. Okay, for the first slide, uh, we go to introduction first. Okay, next, background of study. AI. AI is artificial intelligence. It was intended to be an aid to scientific reasoning, primarily used to solve complicated and challenging mathematical problems. It means artificial intelligence is a process and identify the acquired data and then must to make sure to perform with the certain task. Artificial intelligence is not only focused on robotism, but it can be knowledge of technology or ICT knowledge. Some authors also say that AI refers to the simulation of human intelligence in machines that are programmed to think like human. Artificial intelligence has three types, which is artificial narrow intelligence, artificial general intelligence, and artificial super intelligence. First, artificial narrow intelligence. We can call it as a weak artificial intelligence within three types of AI. This is AI just do the specific task, just follow program in computer. It is also called as natural language process, NLP. Example, facial recognition, speech recognition, and the others. Second, Artificial General Intelligence. We can call it as a strong artificial intelligence. The computer program can perform any intellectual task that human could do. This AI also can solve any problem. For instance, company of Fujitsu, they create one faster supercomputer. They call it as Bull K. The last type of AI is artificial super intelligence. This AI have capability to making decision and solve the problem. It also more capable than human. For example, robotic of Kony that using in Hilton Hotel. Next, about artificial intelligence marketing AIM. AIM is a method for leverage customer data and AI concept like machine learning to anticipate next customer and improve their journey. Next, about problem statement. Problem statement have two. First, low acceptance and recognition about artificial intelligence marketing and still use traditional marketing, not only in hotel industry, but it also affect to tourism industry. It means that in this era, still have people did not use the new technology for marketing their product product or service okay for second problem statement is from Huisington hotel are highly vulnerable to decrease tourism and transport due to the global health crisis of COVID-19 along with a decline in economic development okay, next about research question and research objective this research question was found based on problem statement that I found from the newspaper and journal. Okay, for RQ1, I want to know what type AI that suitable to use for hotel. So that the research objective, I must to investigate the type of AI that suitable for use. So then uh, for the RQ2, I want to know the effectiveness of the artificial intelligence marketing at hotel. Okay, then uh, the research objective, I must examine the effectiveness of artificial intelligence marketing at hotel industry. Then the RQ3, I must to find the impact of using artificial intelligence marketing because the impact will give the best result in the research. Okay, now the literature review of performance expectancy. Okay, the predominant proliferation of smartphone translates from conventional marketing to the marketing of artificial intelligence. Okay, next is about the effort expectancy. The degree of ease associated with the use of the system of the system artificial intelligence. Then the social influence relates to the way to which successful individuals 
influence the use of artificial intelligence marketing for hotel from Fong 2017. Okay, next, the last one is about the facilitating condition. Okay, in this study, as the alleged viability of technical and organizational infrastructure supporting Malacca Hotel and tourist facility management. Okay, next, about the conceptual framework. The way I'm construct the framework from Utaud model, which is unified theory of adoption and use of technology. In this Utaud model, have four independent variables. First, performance expectancy. Second, effort expectancy. Third, social influence. And the last one is facilitating condition. All of these four independent have relationship with behavioral intention to use the artificial intelligence marketing in hotel industry. I'm use the Utaud model because I want to know the effectiveness of artificial intelligence marketing in Melaka Hotel. Okay, for research design, I'm use explanatory because this problem did not have any person do the research about this. And also, I must to generate operational definition focus on explaining about artificial intelligence marketing in Hotel Melaka. For this research, the best methodological choice is quantitative research method because I want to collect the information from existing and potential customer at Hotel Melaka using sampling method by online survey. Okay, for research strategy, I'm use the pilot test because I want to justify the research method. I'm using the quantitative method, so I think the pilot test is the su uh, suitable for quantitative method. Then uh, I'm use uh, sampling method, non-probability sampling. I'm take the sampling uh, to this research because it's not involve random selection, and also uh, in my research sample cannot be calculated. Okay, for question design, I design with three sections. First, session A with demography. Uh, for section B and section C, I'm designed with the question, uh, just follow with Likert skill. For data analysis method, have four, which is, it is about descriptive analysis, reliability test, person correlation analysis, and multiple regression analysis. It is we using in this research for data analysis. That's all from my presentation, final year project. Thank you.